anything that I focus on uh, coming into this combine. Do you work out at running back too? Uh, no, I, I, usually, I spend most of my time uh, doing a lot of receiver work uh, for the combine. Do you feel like a full-time receiver now? Or do you feel like a hybrid? Uh, I can't say I feel like a full-time receiver still, just because um, my running back background. You know, I love the, uh, I love to run the ball. I love to catch the ball. So uh, I say I'm both. I'm still a hybrid. So why are you here as a receiver? Just to show teams that I could also catch the ball and also run those deep routes, like the digs, the posts, the corners, and catch the deep ball. So is it is it your choice? Does the NFL tell you like this? Is what we think you are? So do this. Oh uh, no, the NFL chose what position I. Uh, they, they wanted me to play, and, and I didn't, it didn't really matter to me whether it was running back or receiver. I was going to go out there and put on a productive day. Even though you played both in college, how prepared do you feel right now to be a full-time wide receiver? I'm very prepared. Uh, I spent a lot of my time training at Exos in Arizona, uh, just really working with uh, some good people. Uh, doing a lot of receiver stuff, and I feel good com coming into that. What was your official height and weight? 5'10", 5'10", 196. Curtis, what's your relationship with uh, Michael Thomas? And has he helped you with this transition? Oh, yeah, definitely. I speak to Mike almost every day just about different things to expect uh, coming into this this process and the interview process and just a bunch of things. And also route running, catching a the ball. There's some things, ways I can improve my game. Just a guy like that, you know, how dominant he was at Ohio State and uh, how, how good he did at the, at the National Football League level. I want to take something from a guy like that and also keep speaking to him after the process is done with. What did he tell you about the transition to the pro? Did he tell you how big a jump it was? Oh, yeah, definitely. You just got to sell your – it's just you got to sell your brand in a – in the right way, you know, when you're in public, you always watch, you know, you always look that you can't go around doing the, the same college uh, mistakes, you know, because you're at the National Football League now, you know, the media is everywhere, so just take care of yourself and sell your brand. You kind of laughed when you said 5'10". Do you think you were taller than that? Uh, I thought I was taller than 5'10", but uh, that's what they weighed me, I mean, measured me at, so, I mean, that's what it is. Was the 196 what you were looking for, or was that heavy or light or anything? No, I mean, 196 is what I played around during season 196 through 198 is what I played around the season but uh, I definitely could weigh more but I mean I weighed at 196 so that's a good weight for me. Curtis do you feel you could always fall back to running back and you don't have to prove anything there is that kind of no, not at all. Uh, I still, I, I just knew playing, I was going to play receiver uh, for the combine, so I know I had to work on my skills playing receiver. So I didn't really focus on too much of running back stuff because I, I wouldn't be doing that stuff right now. But definitely after this process is over, I'm going to be working both spots and just still improving my game as a receiver.